cases in Escape from Tarkov are an absolute must-have in order to save stash space, especially if you own the standard edition of the game. While some cases can be very expensive to buy or barter for, a lot of them you can actually get for zero rubles by completing certain tasks. So that's why today we're going to be taking a deep dive into cases and showing you how you can get your hands on a lot of them for absolutely free. All right, so before we jump into it, I kind of want to give you guys a tour of my cases and just show you how powerful these things are. Maybe you're new to the game, you don't know what they are. Basically, cases are going to allow you to store a lot of items in a very small space. So for example, this thick case right here takes up three by five spaces in my stash. But when you open it up, you can see I have a ton of other things in here and you can actually put certain cases inside of other cases. So, so for example, if I didn't have this thick case with all of these other cases inside of it, all of these items inside of these cases would just be in my stash, taking up a ton of space. And as you can see, I have a lot of stuff inside most of these cases and they really just help clean up your stash. As you can see, I've got a bunch of them. This one's for grenades junk box stuff right here this one holds all my ammo boxes and in each of these boxes i have all different kinds of ammo and then down here i've got some items cases for like helmets stuff like that weapon case and just a bunch of different cases that do different things for me so if i didn't have these cases my stash would be completely full and i would not be able to hold the amount of stuff that i have all right so jumping right in we've got my favorite tool here tarkov.dev if you guys haven't tried this out i highly recommend it it is a super helpful tool but as you can see there are a lot of cases in the game and it can be kind of confusing where to get them how to get them whatever but today i'm going to be showing you guys all of the ones that you can get for absolutely free without spending any kind of money now i've broken these down into four different categories we're gonna have the keys and cards these are gonna be cases that obviously hold keys and cards we're gonna have specialty cases which are cases that only hold one type of item and then we're gonna have dedicated cases which basically hold like one specific type of or group of items and then we're gonna have what i like to call the big boys big old honker cases that you get a lot of bang for your buck when it comes to storage all right so in the keys and cards category the first one we're going to be looking at is the documents case so obviously if we scroll down here you can see that for the docs case there is a barter from therapist but we're not here to talk about that you don't want to spend money you want to get this thing for free right here we have two quests that are actually kind of early on in the game that allow you to get a docs case for free so for First up is going to be Nostalgia. This is a Jaeger task. You unlock it at level 28. You're going to have to go to Shoreline, locate this room, grab the photo album, and hand it over to Jaeger, and he will give you a docs case as well as a couple of other things. Next up is going to be the Punisher Part 5 from Proper. This one you're going to unlock at level 20, and this one you're going to have to turn in a bunch of different guns and stuff like that, and then kill some players using specific types of armor, and he will give you a docs case as well as a pistol case, a bunch of USD, and some good ammo. Next up, on our list is going to be the sick case now the sick case is my personal favorite i absolutely love this case but the problem with this one is you're not going to be able to get it for free for a very long time the barter is kind of expensive sitting at around 1.5 mil but you absolutely can get this case for free by completing a quest called stray dogs from our boy jaeger so you're going to unlock this quest at level 35 there's a few that you have to do in order to unlock this i believe a bunch of these are like killing bosses and turning stuff in or whatever but if you're the type of player that hammers out these tasks when you hit level 35 you will be able to unlock this one and as a reward he will give you a sick case for killing knight big pipe and bird eye which are all of the goons all right so jumping over into our specialty case category there's only going to be one in here and that is going to be the injector case and in order to get this one for free you have to complete out of curiosity by therapist basically you're going to get this quest pretty early on at level 11 and all you have to do is locate this truck put a marker on it and then come back and collect your reward i believe this quest is like a three part you could turn it into therapist proper or skier and they all give you a different reward but the reward for therapist is going to be an injector's case all right so moving over to the dedicated cases category this one is going to have a lot in here so buckle up we're going to jump into it first up is going to be the magazine case which i'm sure you all know of there's actually going to be three quests here that you can complete in order to get your hands on these first one is going to be calibration from mechanic this one requires kind of 
of a higher level at level 47. Kill 20 PMCs from over 100 meters away. He's going to give you a mag case, Kiba armband, and five thermites. Next up is going to be gunsmith part 22. This requires you to be level 39. As you guys know, gunsmiths, you build the gun, you turn it into his specs, and he will give you rewards. And for this one, he's going to give you a magazine case. And last up, this is going to be the earliest one that you can do. It unlocks at level two, but obviously you need to make sure you do all of the quests before it. And essentially, you're going to have to kill Rashala, turn in his pistol, and he will bless you with a magazine case. Next up on our list is going to be ammo boxes. This one's kind of a hot topic. It seems like it's basically impossible to get your hands on one of these this wipe unless you pay stupid money for it. There is a barter for it. Um, it's not showing here. I'm not really sure why. I've tried to mess with my settings. But anyways, there's going to be three different tasks that you can do in order to get your hands on seven ammunition cases. Yes, you heard that right. You can get seven of these things for free. And if you already have a bunch of them and you want to sell them, you're looking at a lot of money just by doing these tasks. So first up is going to be trophies from Peacekeeper. This one's a higher level. You got to be level 55. Basically, you're going to find and raid and hand over 20 bear and 20 USEC dog tags that are over level 50. This one's kind of unrealistic. It's kind of an in-game task. But, you know, if you're a grinder and this is something you want to do, there you go. Next up is going to be samples from Peacekeeper. This one is a little bit more realistic at level 21, but you got to find a bunch of stems, turn them in, and he will give you an ammo box. Best way to do this is go ahead and fork over that four mil, buy yourself a black key card, and start running that until you find all these, and you can get it pretty fast. And last up is probably the easiest one, big customer from proper. You got to be level 11, and basically you're going to locate the transport and mark it with a marker. This is, I believe, the second part of the one i talked about earlier where you have to choose between therapist skier and proper so if you choose proper he's going to give you two ammo boxes next up is going to be the grenade case we've got one task here that you can complete in order to get one for free that's going to be chemical part four from skier you unlock this at level 11 and this is going to be the third part of that three-part task that i was telling you about so if you turn it into therapist you get an injector's case if you turn it into proper you get two ammo boxes and if you turn it into skier you get a grenade box from a money standpoint i would take the two ammo cases from a usability standpoint i would probably take the injector case because you get it pretty early on and that is big but gear will give you a grenade box if you complete that task and turn it into him next up is going to be the med case there's actually a bunch of quests here that you can do for this and they're all going to be on therapists so starting out with crisis this is a higher level one you got to be level 48 this one requires you to hand over a bunch of different things three to fifty Simulators, three O scopes, two lead X's, 20 piles of meds, and 10 vitamins. This one might not really be worth, you know, turning in for a med case because you could just sell the lead X's and probably get like two or three med cases but it is there you do get one for free next up is going to be colleagues part three for therapists obviously level 22 you need to be to unlock this one this is going to be the one where you don't kill sanitar turn in 10 lab cards and then turn in some other stems and she will give you a med case but she will also give you a black key card if you want to complete this get this black key card run labs and finish sample you can get a couple of cases for free and last for the med case is going to be healthcare privacy part 10 this is probably going to be the earliest one you unlock it at level 10 this one is super easy you go in a factory find the drop spot and plant three of the blue gunpowders and she will give you a med case this is going to be the easiest way to get your hands on one of these super early and it will be huge in saving space in your stash and last but not least in the dedicated cases category we have the old pistol case that a lot of people seem to forget about you can actually get your hands on four of these things by completing four different tasks from four different traders first up is going to be mechanic over on gunsmith part 21 you need to be level 38 to do this modify this m700 and this 1911 turn them in and you will get a pistol case next up is going to be punisher part 5 from proper this one's a little bit lower level you need to be level 20 and we covered this one earlier when we were talking about the docs case and here you go again he will give you a pistol case also next up is going to be farming part four from mechanic you got to be level 14 to unlock this one basically you turn in three gpus and 15 cpu fans and he will give you a pistol case as well as two bitcoins and four tetrises so not a bad quest to complete and last for the pistol case, we got Peacekeeper. You need to be level 12. This is going to be Cargo X Part 1. Basically, you got to obtain this little tough book right here in the 
the east wing of the health resort and you will turn it in to peacekeeper and he will give you a pistol case now the interesting thing about these pistol cases is you need them to get your hands on a weapon case you got to trade five of them and five blue fuels for a weapon case so that has shot up the price of pistol cases a lot and a lot of times they're sitting around 150 200 250k i haven't looked at them in a long time but they're worth some good money so if you get them from these quests and you don't really care to use them you don't really use pistols you can just sell them on the fleet and make some good money all right and finally we are moving on to the big boys and first up is going to be the standard weapon case now surprisingly there are four different quests that will give you a weapon case for free they're just handing these things out like it's halloween night but anyways first one is going to be on peacekeeper it's called special equipment this one is going to be one of those ones that is late game. You got to be level 60 and you got to turn in a bunch of these items that are kind of hard to find. And he will give you a weapon case as well as unlock a barter for the thick item case. Next up is going to be on mechanic with gunsmith part 25. You got to be level 39 to unlock this. And this is going to be the one where you have to modify the PKP. So not very easy. You can't just buy this gun on the flea. You got to go Molly Wap Caban, kill him, grab this, modify it and turn it in. You will get five bitcoins and a weapon case. Next up is going to be Jaeger with the task Hunter at level 33. Basically, you have to kill Sturman 20 times. Kind of a lot, but if you are a grinder and you want to do that, you can get yourself a weapons case for free. Last up, this is probably going to be the easiest one and the earliest one that you can do. You unlock this at level 20 from Jaeger. It's going to be Huntsman Path Eraser Part 1. And all you need to do is kill Gluhart and leave the raid and he will give you a weapons case. Next up, we're going to move into the thick boys. We got the thick weapon case here. You're only going to be able to get one of these from a task. And it is actually very easy if you just play the game and do your quests and level up. All you have to do is reach level four with all of the traders and you will be rewarded with a thick weapon case. And last but not least, the biggest case in the game, the one that everybody loves, the thick items case now this one you're gonna be able to unlock by completing the task private clinic from therapist and all you need to do is find and raid an ophthalmoscope and a ledx and turn them into her and she will give you this big old honker of a case right here and that might seem a little bit easier said than done so if you guys are interested i'll put up in the top right i have a video on how to find ledexes very easy a lot of people might disagree with me but that's what works for me but anyways you turn these in once you reach level 35 you can turn them in and grab yourself a thick item case so that's gonna do it guys that is going to be all of the cases that you can get in the game for absolutely free i think in total that equals out to around 25 or 28 cases depending on what you choose from that three part that we talked about and in total if you do all of these quests and collect all of the cases you can end up with two docs cases one sick case one injector case three magazine boxes seven ammo cases one grenade case three med cases four pistol cases four weapon cases one thick items case and one thick weapons case that is a lot of cases i just said that word like 14 times my brain is not working properly anyways if you guys enjoyed the video be sure to let me know down below in the comments if you have anything to input i'd love to hear from you but other than that i'll see you guys in the next video